Science tells us that light moves so fast, the only way the average person can understand it is to break the numbers down to the lowest possible unit. In this case, 186,000 miles a second, or for Americans, 720 million miles per hour. Multiply that by a week, a month, a year, and you will start to see why people have no idea how to get their heads around the so-called universe. The Carl Sagan term of billions doesn't even begin to scratch the surface. Neither does trillion, quadrillion, or quintillion. That's 10 to the 18th power, by the way. A number so large that the only people fortunate enough to deal with it on a daily basis have PhDs in astronomy or astrophysics. And it doesn't just apply to space miles. It is also used to estimate the number of stars or galaxies, depending on what textbook you're looking in. Billions, trillions, quadrillions, large names and even larger numbers to make you, the individual, feel small. If you believe science, then you are a single molecule on a microscopic speck flying through an amazingly vast universe at unbelievable speeds. If you believe science, that is. But then they also humanize it for you, show you iconic achievement photos of Americans proudly standing on the lunar surface, driving cars that shouldn't be there, the fear of being stranded or dying apparently not important. They draw cartoons for recruitment posters and put their lead spokesperson in mainstream movies. Then they keep showing you more pictures every day to convince you they are the good guys and not some dark shadow branch of the U.S. government. Here's just a random shot of the moon taken 50 years ago. And here's a shot of the Earth taken from the moon just recently. Here's a close-up look at Saturn, and this one even closer still. Here's a rocket launching into Earth orbit, and here's what it supposedly looks like when you arrive, even though when everyone else flies, they see something like this. Forget what you've been shown. What do your senses tell you? When you're a child, you're told that this is your home. You're not a child anymore. Time to wake up, grow up, and think for yourself. The world isn't what you think it is. It's better, more elegant, more efficient, and easier to understand. This is your home now. It was built with great care and craftsmanship just for you. It is the perfect illusion, designed to help you learn about yourself and each other. There is an awakening happening right now, all around you. The rules and control systems of the past are breaking down. All you have to do is look at it with an open mind and let it sink in. Then you will start to understand the possibilities that take you from being just a speck to that of an intimate creative force sitting in a giant room waiting to show itself. Trust your senses and join us.